Dave Chappelle is my dad. No, he's not my real dad, but he's taught me valuable lessons that my father never could because he wasn't really around. He's reached a large audience and encouraged them to open their minds to greater concepts such as race, trans rights, and money in Hollywood. Dave Chappelle introduced me to black inequality, specifically black on black crime in his um, special titled Killing Them Softly. <laughs> in this special, he does a skit, a bit, where him and his friend, I believe his name is Chip, um, go out, and while they're out, they um, get pulled over by the police because they were, well, racing a police car. And Chip's response to the police officer is, I didn't know I couldn't do that. The police says, go on, get out of here. And so they do. Now, Dave at first thinks that his white friendship just got lucky. However, it happens again when his friend decides to ask a police officer for directions while high on marijuana. Dave Chappelle also has another bit. <laughs> this one is hilarious. It's a very famous bit where um, a black person er, is in his home and some white cops come in and bonk him on the head and uh, open and shut case, Johnson. <laughs> um, he, he is able to portray police brutality and black inequality in a, in a way that's understandable to everyone because he introduces, us, he introduces it to us in the same way that it was introduced to him. In his recent special, titled 846, he addresses George Floyd's murder, murder at the hand of police, um, in a very passionate, passionate special. Um, he encourages his audience to see the bigger picture, to understand that all of these brutalities that are occurring, that they're all connected. However, Dave Chappelle, like all fathers, is slightly homophobic. Dave Chappelle, in his recent, one of his recent stand-ups, addresses his trans jokes, and um, he states that some of it may be that he's jealous. The trans community has managed to progress quite quickly in America compared to the black community. Um, Dave says that this may be due to the fact that a lot of trans people are rich white men. Dave Chappelle also opens up about his own personal experience with a trans person and how this may have led to his own biases towards the trans community. Dave Chappelle is not perfect. However, he doesn't strive for perfection. He strives for knowledge. I think he's more than a comedian. I think that he is a figure that we should all look up to a little bit, but not too much. Just as we look up to our own dads. He's taught me a lot about race, about money, and, and how you shouldn't take money just because it's being handed to you. It could be corrupt. There could be something else behind it. You could be selling a piece of yourself. I think that Dave Chappelle has impacted people in an incredible way. I think that he has shined the light on issues that have been left in the dark in people's minds for far too long. And I can't wait to see where he goes next with his career. Thank you very much for watching.